important. Now, let me start by saying that money is very important subject in the mind of many people. You know, uh, both wise and the fools speak of money are the essential role it plays in every, you know, in every day lives of people. Now, let me tell you this, that many have died because of money and many are alive because of money. So life itself is not evil or the root of evil. You know, there are some people, they quote the Bible wrongly by saying that the love of money is the root of all evil. You know, when you don't even have money, it's evil because you are tempted to do what is not right. Now, a lack of money can actually fuel spread of evil and poverty. So, and that's why we keep on telling people how to make money. It's very, very important. It is useful. It's of use of money. It, it is used of money that makes it good of or evil. The way you use money, people should understand, the way you use money is what makes it either good or evil. Money itself is neutral. So I want us to understand that. that look here, you are looking for money, money is available, but money is neutral. Now, the experience of many Nigerians, a uh, few days now, concerning money matters, spoke volumes and continue to speak volumes. You know, we should learn from this and look for alternative uh, means of getting or using money without a physical cash. If you notice a reason today, I mean, some time ago now, when there is a change of currency, when Nigerians few days, you know, some months ago, consigning money matters speaks volumes. I want to speak volumes. We should learn from this and look at alternative means of getting or using money without using physical charge. This is an information age. You know, a lot of people, they are traders, they are not able to sell, they are depressed. They should understand that we are in information age. And that matters that the best solution to a problem lies in taking action to approach it, not to cut the branch of the problem. That's what a lot of people are having, okay? They, 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 they don't know that there's, when you cut the branches of a tree, it can actually grow back. So everyone must decide either to make money to make money a slave or a master that's a very important thing is either you make money as a slave or make money as a master now so to the wise money is a tool but to the to the foolish money is a master i repeat to the wise money is a tool and but to the fool money is a master now in whatever you are doing you must apply wisdom in handling money now let me quickly look at this what are some things that can attract money to us this is very very important a lot of people are looking for money. Some goes even as far as doing ritual, but they don't know that's not the way to get money. So what are the things that actually can attract money to us? Number one, there are thousands and one things that can bring us money, that can bring us to the secrets of financial wealth. That's where wealth now comes in, okay? What are some of these? Number one, working and work is, uh, working and work is smart, not only hand. Some people believe that until they, they work, they, they leave their house or they hold something or they, they, they you know, that they are physically connected. You know, that's where they can make money. No, sir. Okay. So, number two, having skill that can be monetized. A lot of people, God has given them talent. And whether you like it or not, you can use your talent to convert to money. Okay. Now, selling. You also can be selling something. I keep on telling people. Don't always want to buy things, buy things, buy things every day. What do you say? Try and sell something a day. You are buying Maggi, okay? Can you sell it? You are drinking pure water, can you sell it? Okay, you are buying toothpaste, okay? Can you sell it? Try and sell something, okay? Very, very important, okay? Having solution to problem is a form of a service. You have to, you can provide, when you are providing solution to problem, perennial problem, okay? For example, let me give you an example, which perhaps I'm gonna be telling us maybe as time goes on. Do you know there are business you can be doing and be making money per hour? Do you know that there's a business you can do and be making money per week? Do you know there's a money that uh, business you can do and be making money per month? There's a business you can do, you can be making money per three, three months. There's a business you can do and be making money for six, six months. There's a business you can do and be making money once in a year, but it's a lot of millions. So you must have a way of providing, you know, solution to problems one of service. That's a service. Now, having asset generating machine is also very important. Having, having, you know, asset that can generate machine is also a very important way of making, there's a lot of investment opportunity. Now, to activate all this opportunity, there are things actually you need to do, okay, to actually activate it, you know, and that is very, very important. And these are the steps by which you can make money and make a lot of impact in life. Like I keep on telling people, if only, some people tell you that, if only I have money, I will be able to achieve my dreams. Now, let me tell you, it's, you don't, it's not all about money, but there are some things you need to put in place to generate that money. This is one of the statements that has kept many people in the circle of poverty until I have money. I cannot make it. If I come to seminar, where's the money? I'm going to know, you see, you know. So you must know why. It is because money never answers to, 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 to wishes. 
please also know this money never answers to wishes i will and when is the next time when is the next seminar when they, when they say there are programs that you need to get training that will lift you forward please make yourself available don't give time okay so if you are keeping if you are keeping wish wishing you wishing you have money you will never even have you will never smell money so please this is a very important thing that we must take note of if actually we want to make money and let me tell you that there are actually some money signs if you want to be financially wealthy okay making money managing money and multiplying money are learnable skills I repeat, making money, managing money, multiplying money, they are what? They are manageable skills. You must acquire skills to make money. When you acquire, you, you, acquire, you, you, you acquire it and you make use of it, you are, going to, you, you are going to make a lot of money. Now, most people's attitude, uh, the attitude, their financial problem to be spiritual, they say, ah, if I don't have money, maybe they have cost him, or maybe they are, is the mother that is, no, 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 no. With all the prayers, prayer cannot change that. There are some things you just need to do. God gave you mouth, you know, for you to eat, you need to actually lift up your hand and put the food in your mouth. God will not put the food in your mouth. There are some things God cannot do, and people should actually know this now. Money does not rain on your head from heaven. You have to work for it. That when you now work, God will bless you and you make money. Okay, so it is not all about spiritual, but lack of knowledge. The Bible said that my people perish for lack of knowledge. You need knowledge also to acquire money. You no, know, try knowledge. Like I said, you need to try knowledge. How do you get knowledge? Attend training programs. Okay, it will help you to actually attract money. To try knowledge on financial literacy. Apply it when you see, then you begin to see the difference. Like I also said that another money sense that I want to tell people today is that harness the power of focus. You need to apply the, and there's the power of focus. Filter out the nose. Let go of what isn't and give a full attention to what you want most in life. Focusing on what you, you do with what you want in life, make more returns to new ideas and opportunity that move you closer to your dream. Okay, you want to achieve your dream. You want to make more money, be more focused. Focusing, like I said, is very important. You, you, you begin to see evidence that support the results you want in your life when you are focused. That is the money sense, okay? You begin to see the evidence. Now, improve your ability to control your thoughts and identify and eliminate, eliminate distraction every day. Once you decide to make money, somebody will tell you that that is what I did in the last time I didn't make it. Don't listen to distraction, be focused, okay? Make all your financial decisions, keeping your vision, you know, uh, keeping your vision in mind. It's also very, very, and then let me tell you, you know, I, I believe in affirmation. To make money, you also need to be talking to yourself. Now, you can affirm, let your affirmation today, as you go, before you go out, every day, you can speak this type of word and you can see money, you know, because you need to actually affirm, okay? You cannot be saying, I want to make money and you hate money money like you know being attracted and you have to speak some positive word to also attract money but remember skill is very important focus is very important now you can say all the money i have uh, all the money i have bring me joy you can say that all the money i have bring me joy whether small or big i can reach my uh, you can also say that i can reach any income i want okay because income brings money you also can say that i am bringing in extra money every day i am bringing money every day you also can tell you can be saying affirm to yourself on daily basis i am making a profit from all my investment don't speak don't speak negative about money. Stop speaking negative. When you see people going on the road and they carry big vehicles, they are stupid people. They don't steal money again. See them. Yeah, yeah, people. It don't go better for them. Don't say that, okay? And make it, so you keep on saying positive things about money. Then again, you know, I have freedom to, to pursue anything I want. Say it also. You also can say that I have multiple low maintenance positive, uh, positive mental streams. You also can say my mind is filled with thought of abundance. You know, my mind, say it every morning. My mind, when you wake up in the morning, my mind is filled with thought of abundance and you also can say i gracefully accept wealth into my life i gracefully accept wealth into my life i find the right opportunity at the right time with this affirmation i can tell you that money casually can be your own you don't need to be big to start to make money but let me say this no matter where you are in your financial journey you must think about ways to maximize your income i think that's that's very very important okay and uh, make a conscious effort to improve your professional skill you're a professional start small with your professional skill try to make most of the money you earn you know, it's not the question of I don't have money. I think the problem people have is how to use what they have to get what they want. Now, you also need to create a viable investment plan and explore a new method of managing your resources so you can find assets that can outpace your infl inflation. Very important. Inflation is about 22.22%. Okay. Now, to also succeed with money, you need to stick with a long-time strategy and give your money time to grow. Give your money time to grow. Start small, but grow over it. You understand me? That's a way actually to actually get it. Yes, very important. Then make a habit of investing regularly. Don't say nothing. Don't say this thing does not work. Don't say, ah, the, the other one, the one we even came, we've not done anything. Keep on learning, okay? Form the habit of investing regularly. 
You understand me? Don't say because the one I've done actually have not. Then, actually, like I said, any, 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 uh, in, in all things. So those are very important things, and you also need to understand that money is within you. You understand me? You must also know that money is within you. And whether the money is small or whether the money is big, money is that until you have built a system that doesn't sleep, you don't deserve to sleep. You must deserve something. I know we've been talking about export for some time now. When you send good, you know, you you you, you don't export is not something that you keep on doing every minute, every second. Once you have sent the commodity, you wait part time for the money to come and the money will come. So, you know, that's a good business. It's, you know, so you, 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 you so, so like I said, until you build a system that doesn't sleep, you don't deserve to sleep. Nothing, like I said, is expensive. It is you who cannot afford it. You know, Mary, the fuel price now is 500 naira per liter. When I pass through today, in all the filling stations, you know that they are keen to buy it for 500. I never see any, any filling station with fuel that people are not going there to buy. So, Money, nothing is expensive. Mary, it is you who cannot afford it. Now, there are two types of economy. The one that is created for you and the one you created. Very important. There are two types of economy. The one that is created for you, okay, and the one you created. So the question is that, which economy have you created for yourself that could give you money, okay? You are not poor. Please, like I said, not because of people say, be poor people, people, there's nothing there. You know, there are poor people there, but you actually can come from that. There are, there are, there are, there are, there are you are not poor, as you are listening to me this morning. You are only an untrained, wealthy man or unwealthy man or woman. You are not poor. You are only an untrained, wealthy man or woman. Now, the rich raise money through cash flow system. The poor gather and save money to solve their problem. These are very, very insightful thoughts, which I think we must understand to make money. The poor, those people say small, small something. You know, they gather money or save money to solve problem. That is why their problem cannot be solved. Now, when you see an opportunity that can benefit your life, don't think of money involved to be interested. Okay? Some people say, ah, if we do export now, hey, is it not container? How am I going to collect my money? And they only talk about it. Okay? What about it? So think more of the benefits and plug in mentally. Then proceed to think of ways and means to attract or raise the money involved, which is called OPM, which is called other people's money. Now, nobody, no, no one owes you money except the one you owe yourself. <laughs> nobody owes money. But everybody, everyone can have access to money, including yourself. You understand me? Now, no one owe you anything except the things you owe yourself. You are the, you are the, you are your biggest debtor. And one thing again, you need to understand about money is that the only true way to raise enough money to combat serious issue in life is cash flow system. Okay, you have to create avenue through which money can come in uh, through this method. Then pass basically, uh, uh, you'll be definitely financial free. So, like I said earlier on, uh, because of time, okay, maybe you just try to see what you actually can do uh, when money start coming in. What you need to do, uh, you know, when your money starts, when you start making money, then you're on your way to be financially free. Now, in that, you actually you, you need to have a budget. You need to save. You need to invest. You need to monitor your credits. You need to bargain. You know, uh, each time I want to buy things, I don't buy things in one place. I go to about three or four places, and I'm telling you the basic truth. Okay? So don't just say you went to a place and they said it's the amount you just put your money to your pocket and buy it. No, check three or two or three other stores. You'll be surprised. Something that somebody is selling for five hundred, you can bargain it for three fifty for four hundred. That hundred hundred naira you are saving can actually make you some money. Okay? Learn what you must learn. Learn what what must be learned. Okay? You need to learn. You know uh, what must be learned. Don't hook onto uh, you know things you have been using before, or perhaps what you know. You know, take care of uh, of your things. You know, whenever you have money and you used to buy something, don't allow it to waste away. You know, uh, and it's very very important. Live you know below your means. It's also very good. A lot of people they like show off. Okay, you have a neighbor who is actually his, his child is going to a school of you know seven hundred thousand or one million naira per term, and your income does not get to that. You are just under about two hundred or three hundred per month. You see, please live beyond. Don't live beyond your Yourself. Take you know, try as much as possible, live below your means. You know, then also you need to get expert advice. Like for people who are listening to me right now, you want to get more details on how to get money, you can go to my YouTube channel, export. <laughs>